Hey guys, it's Banner. Welcome back to some more Mario Galaxy. We got 18 stars left and there are still no more comets. I don't know why. Why are none of the other galaxies throwing their purple purple comets at us? Um nope. jump. For goodness sake. Jump. Okay, so uh, I looked it up and oh, I also changed my battery by the way. Because I know it's been bugging people over the past couple of parts. Um uh, but anyway, yeah. So I look, I looked it up. I finally found out where the other two, where the other two stars were in uh, the hidden stars. And by finally, I mean I just held them off for one part. That was about it. Okay, so firstly, we're gonna head into Deep Dark Galaxy because we got a hidden star. I believe this one is in the first galaxy. The first galaxy. It's in the first star. Is it the first one? Yeah, it's the first one. Now the problem with being the first one is that now we gotta go up and grab another. Freaking firefighter, and you know what? I'm actually gonna ignore. I'm going to ignore grabbing the. I, I like how the skybox works, by the way. Okay, so you see the skybox, you see how it's like there, and then as soon as we enter the atmosphere, the other one, it's like, oh, it's all starry now. It's magic. So you can't freaking. Pick Did I just destroy the fire flower? By touching it with the rainbow star, wow. I don't care. I'm grabbing that. <laughs> so anyway, yeah. Uh, anyway, this one is in a place that I wouldn't have looked at. A toad standing there. How does a toad swim? Anyway, this one is in a place that I probably would have found out eventually. But, not for thorough looking. Because it's not that big of an area, really. It is quite a fair place to look, especially, this is probably one of the more hidden ones, even. You just need to know that you gotta grab a shell, and then you've gotta go over to where all the bombs are. And you see, yeah. And then you've gotta throw the shell, set them all off, which will apparently explode the ship, and... By the way, I believe all the mines come back anyway. Yeah. Uh, but anyway, you can launch yourself out of the planet and into what the wiki calls the boo box. Anyway, you need to jump. Oh. It's kind of a weird box because one, it's raining. Oh, oh, come on, that thing wiggled. Oh, come on. Oh, don't you freaking die on me. Stop. Why the... Okay, there you go. I hit it. There you go. You've got to hit it until you get. Oh. I'll I'll take the I'll take the coin. Ah. Ah. There you go. Hit that. Now you've got to hit this, and that will shine a light. Where you can get the boo to just be an idiot and walk straight through it. Or it'll float into it. Now the problem is that it goes onto the ground. Can we get this in the wrong gravity? Probably not. Because that thing's just going to chase. Oh crap! Jeez, that was close. I got it. Run! Get it! 
Alright, got it. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Appreciate it, bro. I appreciate it. Hold on. Oh, okay, I'm gonna cut the accent because I know someone's gonna hate me on it. Anyway, so we got that. Deep Dark Galaxy is completo. Doing a box. We've still yet to do the. the Speedy Comet for uh, Dreadnought. Kind of interesting. Oh, we haven't done the... Oh, there you go. <laughs> uh, I, I also noted where the, where the Hidden Star was. Hidden Star isn't actually that far. It may be challenging, though. But it's not that far. It's not far from the beginning. In fact, it's the same star as this one. So I'll give you a hint. It's on the first planet. So anyway, we're going to do a speed run. Of the whole star. Whole star? In fact, both... This and the next galaxy have speedruns for their final stars. For the thing I was. But for some odd reason, the red one comes on. Maybe just to point out the difference. You know, in the last star you could possibly do that involves these guys. And you're teaching them exactly that one has a spike on its head and the other one doesn't. I don't know. Where's the other one at? Where you at, yo? Where you at? There you at. Oh, oh, you missed. Nope. I missed. I missed. Get it. There you go. Dude, I'm floating! <gasps> well, maybe it's just because the hitbox is a bit weird. Anyway, let's go! Woo! Alright, now we gotta get all the... Now it's a... So now they got both a red and a green one. Color diversity. Alright, nope, don't need you red one, I need you green one. Yes, I got five minutes, I know. I'm out of time and I've only got four minutes. Five minutes. <laughs> okay. Now, remember this part? Is the live stream still there? I don't think the live stream's there anymore. Another one up. Woo! So anyway, yeah, it's the same star that we did last time. Last part. Except now we're doing it tons faster because one, I'm not looking at the freaking ch chest. Ow, why didn't you turn off? Alright, I'm not doing that anymore. Okay, let's go for that live stream there. Got it. Gotta move that gear up. I like how there's three of them. That's just like, overkill much, really. Anyway, and we're here. See, it only takes like two minutes to get over here. Two, two minutes, fifteen. Even with my failures. And then it takes like fifteen seconds to get on top. And then, let's see if we can actually beat this boss in half the time that it's beat. Oh crap. For a second I was about to get hit. That would be a kill to my reputation. Oh. Yeah, let's see if we can actually beat this whole stage before three minutes. Oh crap, what the... There you go, I got it. I was having a little bit of trouble there, I don't know why, but... So they gave me six minutes for the stage, and I had three minutes ten left. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, so we're back to the place where the dreams are born. And we've got 16... <laughs> it's not Disneyland. And we've got 16 stars left. It's not Disneyland, it's the garden. It's the garden. It's okay, yes. It's not Disneyland, but... It's the next best thing. Actually... It's... I don't know, yes. Anyway, so... 
So yeah, remember when I said it's on the first planet? How the heck did I not look here? Ah! <laughs> okay. And then you're going, oh crap, it is like Battle Rock. Yes. In the ammo depot, we have plenty of bombs! See, I think the previous... Ah, oh, stuff one. Stuff it. This one's... This one is pretty tough. Because you need... Instead of five, you need six. Yeah, and you're also going to need to try and plan it diagonally. Diagon Alley. Oh, crap. I think I messed it up. Yeah, I botched it up. Kinda weird though, the other one didn't go off. Thankfully, it doesn't auto-kill you. Unlike some other things, Sunshine. Not Sunshine as in directly speaking to you, I mean like Sunshine as in Mario Sunshine, although probably... Probably, unless if you don't know Mario, then... you be thinking of talking to you directly, in which case it's kinda weird. Yeah, I threw a diagonal at first, and I was like, ah, oh, dang it. And you just gotta try and nail the... Nail the process. I think that's a little bit too far over. Why the heck? You've gotta try and get it to go off, as well. With the last one, because it takes six seconds. It takes five seconds for the thing to go off. So therefore you need at least five seconds on the last one, or you just gotta blow it up at the same time. Like, I seem to be doing it for this first one. That was way too far over. Way too far over. Yeah, that was way too far over. Stylish death! <laughs> okay. Alright. Jeez, I'm having trouble with this. I, it's... it's... tough. I'll say that. Oh gosh, what happened to the aspect ratio on FPV? Again, too far over. Oh, I'm throwing it way too early. <laughs> for a second, I thought I actually got it there for a second. I was like, what? Alright. Yes, I would like to blow it all up. See, the thing is that, like, how come blowing all of it up works, but if you're missing one, I don't know. Alright, let us not throw it as hard. Yeah, that works. Oh, crap. Jeez, that will work. That will work. Actually, wow, that did work. Yeah, that'll work. Oh, crap. Yeah, how did that not go off? Oh! The other one worked. Yeah, sure. Uh, uh. How much garbage is there? That's like 15. Yeah, yeah, that's 15. So the one time we're actually getting good. Wow, really? It's not going off. I don't know why. Maybe I'm throwing it too early for the first one. 
Go for the one on the right. It's weird, I, I, I can't seem to do it! I would like to do the rest of the galaxies, you know? You know what? Boom! See, even with that bit of a shortcut there, I only did I only had two seconds left. Jeez. Maybe you gotta do it like that. <laughs> Knock off the two on the right, and then you can hit the one right next to it. Oh, gosh. Okay. So that took a lot longer than I expected, but we'll work around it. Uh, uh. So anyway, yeah. So we've done those two galaxies now. Completely. Including the purple coins, which is kind of strange why we've done that, but okay. And now we're going to start the third galaxy and the final galaxy in the game that's not the other one that we've got to do for the Hungry Wing one. Uh, so anyway, Melty Molten Galaxy. This one I like a lot. It's just that it's not as hard as Dreadnought. It involves a lot of lava, so yeah. That is the challenge. Anyway, I like this first star especially, the Sinking Lava p Spire. Pyre? Spire. The Pyro kind of works. Pyro. Anyway. I like this open section. By the way, by the way, hint hint open section purple coins. Uh, yeah. It's kinda tricky jumps, but other than that, you just got kind of platforms. I mean yeah, you know, you get kind of large platforms to Platforming on. Uh, a fun fact, I looked up. You know how there was the billboard in Rolling Greens and then there was the fillboard somewhere else? I believe you can get quite a few star bits, and I know it's kind of pointless getting star bits here. You can get a lot of star bits just by doing this. And then one thing I like is that, oh snap, lava's going up. Quick! Michael Bay! <laughs> oh, Hungry Luma. Oh, if it's 80. If it's 80. It's 80, dang it. Uh, can I grab like two more? Can I grab like two more from somewhere? Oh, dang it. Oh, I can grab two more there. Quick, go back! Back it up! So professional. Hey, I, I might as well feed him. So that's the last hungry bloomer in the game. Yeah. Do, 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 do. But we're not going over there. We're gonna. Uh, yeah. They do reuse a fair amount of content, but considering, you know, there's there's some pretty awesome music in this game. Ah! Lava butt. Not lava butt, lava butt. Oh crap. <laughs> I was going, oh gosh. Anyway. I like it, you just kind of go over here and there's like a ruined spaceship. Space junk, I guess. Power off, maybe. Anyway, I also like how it's one giant planet and there's just several different sections on it. Which seem to have their own gravity because this one seems to point you down. Ah, my butt. So, yeah, these geysers are. They act just like lava. Not like real lava, just Mario lava. Burns your butt. Take a hit. Reference Mario 64, take three hits out of eight. Mario 64's health system is a bit weird. <laughs> this health system, very simple, and I like it because of that. 
And then this is the awesome bit. Holy snap! The precipice! And then we're gonna do this Goo Manchu style. Ready, set! Actually, to be quite honest, I think Rain Rain Man 3 did pretty much a similar concept. Just climb up as even a lava level. As the lava goes up. It was the Hoodlum the Hoodlum hideout or something. Whatever that stage was. And I think the Tower of the Lepers was the next one. Yeah. And the lava in that looks really weird. It was like all gooey. See, this lava, it's got like the nice texture, but like look at Rayman 3's lava. It's just kind of weird. You can get one up there, but why would you get one ups? By this stage, you would have probably found out that one ups are kind of pointless. I mean, they're good if the stage is hard, but it's not that tough. Yeah. Bum. Anyway, so we got 14. Oh, 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 oh. oh, there's a hungry. Oh, crap. There's two hungry limits. Crap, 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 crap. Jeez, I was thinking. 1200, why is it lower? Uh, so anyway, we're gonna head off to Mul Melty Molten, and I was just kind of realizing now I'm gonna need 2000 star bits, so. Crap, we're gonna need to try and build them up. So, anyway, through the Meteor Storm. This involves meteors, if you did not know. Also involves balls. <laughs> So yeah, I'm gonna need to be picking up quite a few star bits considering we gotta feed that hungry luma outside. I, I didn't realize there was another hungry luma. I thought the one outside gate was that. Apparently, no, that's a different one. I don't care. Ah, my butt. Oh, uh, you gotta get this guy to light the fires while picking up star bits because there's a lot of star bits in the stage. Very lot of star bits. A very lot. Anyway, can you long jump it? I may as well try it. Nope, they've got the anti long jump barrier. I just wanted to try it. I just wanted to try it. It's a thwomp. It's a thwomp. I actually really like this little bit here. Oh, that was a tough one up. <laughs> Not only is the one up in a in a very easy place, it's also in the safety, so you're pretty much obliged to get it. It's like, oh, here's the one up, by the way. <laughs> anyway, I love the reflections. I mean, like seriously. This game just pulled off so many really cool texture effects. That's why it looks so good. And that's what every modern game has tried to pull off. Just the texture effects that Mario Galaxy kind of did already. Well, they may pull it off in HD, yeah. But still. Ah, my butt! Uh, where's the last one? The last one like down here? No. Oh, it's up there. Ah, the blue thingos. It's kind of weird also, the meteors barrage in the same places over and over again. Like, there's gonna be one that's gonna hit here. There you go. 69! Anyway, so... I actually don't know if I'm gonna clear the third star, but I may as well go for that. And, uh, that we activate already. I really like this bit, by the way. This bit's pretty cool, too. So it's like, okay, so you've gotta go all the way back to the beginning with a bullet bill? It would seem like a bullet bill, because why wouldn't it be a bullet bill? Do, do, do. Oh crap. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. What a jerk. Alright, we're going to do this on the outside. 
Ah, oh, crap. It's a challenge in because it's a lot of them. Alright, now the now the really tricky part is trying to get in here. There you go. Got it. Yeah. Woo! Upset the neighbors! Alright, would you like to get that one up or this one up? I'm gonna go get this one. I got it! <laughs> oh, jeez. That was a very good one up, wasn't it? You know, it's weird, the one up respawns. So basically, it's like, oh, you can you can totally pull off this jump. Alright, I got this. Got it! Yeah. Now, the other thing is that you don't want to get hit and you also don't want to fall in the holes. What did I just say? You don't want to fall in the holes? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean that. I meant don't fall in your face. I also like how the music is actually slightly different. Oh, crap. How on earth do you get holes like that? In fact, how do you even get lava on platforms like this? It makes no sense. Then again, you know, you've got a plumber being unexposed, rolling a glass ball with a star on it in space. Then, yeah, why am I questioning it? It's just that, like, volcano stages, they make sense, because there's a volcano, so obviously there's something really hot. And I'm not gonna... I don't trust that small platform, I'm going for the big one. Alright, and off we go. I do like how they incorporate that. Out of all things, they incorporate the ball in the last galaxy. They don't incorporate the manta ray or the bubble any other time, although the bubble was in a hidden star and gold leaf. I'll, I'll give it that. But like, they don't incorporate, um, the loop de swoop guy anywhere else. Kinda weird. Then again, they don't incorporate the boat in Mario Sunshine anywhere else. Maybe because people got annoyed with it. I actually have never played Sunshine. And the rage comes up. Anyway, so yeah, we got two and a half minutes, I may as well go. Oh. See, I was gonna go towards the, um... Oh, I thought it was a Speedy Comet, actually. Jeez. Did I say it was a Speedy Comet only in the pie, and then it was a dead one. But anyway, you gotta do the Lava Spire. Now, thankfully, it's just the Spire. It's not... Actually... Hold on. Hold on, I'm getting something. Nope, it's the entire stage. Thank goodness. Now I have to use up my entire part. Again, the Comet has gotten in the way of the end of the part. Like, I was going to do a short star, and then I was like, oh no, you got a comet. So you weren't supposed to jump it like that, you were supposed to just wait until this bit kind of happened. Yeah, I thought it was a speedy comet, actually. Maybe it's because I remember this music. I can get more star bits. Also, star bits can bounce on lava, I thought I'd like to know that. Star bits are stronger than lava. Lava's not not strong, it's just it's very good at burning things. Lava is actually kind of fun because until you tell kids that it's liquid. Oh I'm sorry, that's actually made out of rock. I also love the lava the lava spires just coming out of the ground there. Oh, I bet you I'm gonna get 80 right here. 80 right there. Oh, 81. 84. Alright, now let's try and not get hit. Now, this one's pretty tough because one, it's the entire stage. What other Daredevil run has done? Oh, crap. And you know what? The buzzer's gonna go off as well, but I don't care! 
We shall do this. We shall just keep getting more star bits. I'm sorry I can't hear you over the sound of my money. I'm guessing this will be a good one for star bits when you think about it. You can get quite a lot of star bits on this stage. This game was quite difficult, I will say that. Or it is difficult. It is still challenging. There's the buzzer. I'm sorry, I've got a Daredevil comment. Oh gosh. Jeez, I hit that platform way too early. Wait. For the steam geysers. You don't want Valve to get on you. Where's this part would be? Valve time. And length. Valve time and length. Be forever! Actually, anyway, more stop it! Yay! I don't really have that much to say with the end of the game. Oh, then stop it! Woo! So yeah, you just get like tons of one-ups. Like I've already got 178 just for playing the same section twice. 179. There you go. All right. Whoa, gosh. What are you about to do there? Actually, yeah. Hold on. Why did I try that? Jeez, I'm a dumb pants. Okay. Getting more star bits. <laughs> I'm honestly not doing this for the star bits. I'm just really taking my time for some reason. I'm not doing it for the money, I'm doing it for the wealth. See, it, yeah, you just get tons of star bits. I mean, this beginning bit, there's quite a few moments to get hit, but it's not the toughest part. And I've only died twice. And I've got tons of star bits already. Like 212, that is a lot. It's not, um... Sling Star. It's not that one. Yeah, still. You just get like stop it here, stop it there, stop it everywhere, everything. See now I've got more stop it than the Jodo. Yes. All right, 277. What Pokemon is that? 278. I'm thinking it's Puccina, but I'm not too sure. Alright. I thought you could shortcut across there, but... I guess it seems not. Oh, what?! 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 <laughs> okay, I'm done. <laughs> I'm done with that. Alright, come on, we can, we can finish this. This year, maybe. Holy snap, 300 star bits. I have really nothing to say. I'm just going, yeah. I'm actually kind of hungry. I will take a snack -a break after this if it makes you feel better. Wahoo! Here I go! Okay, what Pokemon are we up to now? 360... 72? 373? 74? I think we're in the legendaries of Owen now. Alright. Get what? 384, that is. The one before Deoxys. No, one before Gir Girachi. Not an event, I don't think. And now we're up to. 
for terror, I believe. <laughs> you know you've got too many Starbits if you're counting them in Pokemons. Pokemons. 409, I have no clue. I know Bidoff is... No, the Barrel's 400, I think. So, yeah. Which, I can't remember who 300 was. I can't remember 300 and I have no clue about 500. 500 would be Oshawa, wouldn't it? Yeah, okay. Uh, because I know 100 is Voltorb. Everybody knows that. I know 200 is Mistrevious, because I love the whole Index too much. That, that's not the whole Index, Dumbo Pants. That's the... Why did I jump straight out? Dang it. That's not the whole Index, it's the Johto Dex, Dumbo Pants. Oh, we passed Munchlax. Pass Munchlax. Okay, let us actually f clear this. For some I didn't get hit on my actual run of this, but I just seemed to be get. Actually, I did get hit. I got hit once. Alright, we're further than we had gone before. It's a miracle. Aussie Skippy. There you go. There you go. We finally did it. Now, no Starbots here. Oh, there they are. Dude, we're about to go past the Sinnoh decks on the Starbots. Jeez. And I know I'm dragging this on way too long for my own good. It's a very long stage. I'm surprised that this was the entire Daredevil bit. Now, unfortunately, those guys don't get their flame back if you knock them into the geysers. It's only just the lava. Oh, it's only just the lava where they get their flame back. Alright, come on, come on, come on. Okay, we're finally up to this bin. I didn't get hit here, so I'm pretty okay, but I don't want to die anyway. And... Hold on. We're not past the Synodex yet. 486, who was that? Can't remember. Dialga. I think. I think it's Dialga, I'm not too sure. So many Starbits, seriously. And there's also so many Pokemon, yes. Alright. Oh, jeez, the music changed. <laughs> no, it didn't. Uh, 494, we're officially, yeah, we're officially up to Superior. <laughs> I think he's supposed to stand on that platform, but I, had, I didn't do it either time. Uh, hold on. Oh, crap. We're up to uh, Embor. Why did I think Grumpig? It's Tepig. And by the way, that's one thing I don't like about the fifth chance, it's just that, you know, the ideas have already been done before. We've got Starly in the fourth... Whenever I heard the name Starly in the, f in the first... in the fourth gen, I thought they were saying Starly. Fortunately, they're completely different. But, you know, still, like, the names are quite similar. Okay, there's the star, we finally did it. stretched on for like 38 minutes. Ooh. I am sorry, but I wanted to get that star because now we've got 12 left! Woo! Alright, I'll save the game and I'll get some lunch because it's like 2.18. Alright, I'll see you kids then. So many starbits. I'm sorry for dragging that one out. Okay. Ow! I